going on everybody today is Sunday September 1st and I'm back with another Uber Eats potentially DoorDash potentially Postmates ride along um, so I just got my first order for Uber Eats I was waiting in my house and I'm off to this local taco place it's about five minutes away um, I know I've been gone for a while, but I was actually had a fever for a little over three weeks straight. Still don't know what the issue is. Um, we have, or I have a CT scan scheduled for Tuesday and this appointment with a specialist on Thursday of this week. Um, so hopefully we'll get things squared away and there's nothing major. And I hope everybody's having a nice Labor Day weekend. I'll see you in a bit. Alright, so it's 10 after 6. And I actually just dropped off my second order. Um, when I got right to the first restaurant, I ended up picking up a second order while I was waiting for the food. So I dropped both of those off. Um, and just before... I arrived at the second drop-off location. I ended up getting a third order. Um, so now I'm headed on my way to a different Mexican restaurant. See you all in a bit. Up at 1408 Louisiana Street. So it is 6.30 p.m. I just dropped off my third delivery and Right when I dropped it off, before I got back to my car, I got another one. So Uber Eats is hot tonight. I don't know if it's just because it's Labor Day weekend or what. We are busy, and it's amazing. It's good to be back. It's been so long. So, I'm just pulling in now to the sushi place to pick up my next order. It's 6.34, so it wasn't a far trip. We were at Shiki Sushi and Japanese Grill. I don't know if you can read that. So it is 6.47 p.m. Uh, about two minutes ago, I dropped off that last order and I got another one for another uh, Mexican place, Cinco de Mayo this time. Um, it's not a taco truck, an actual like sit down restaurant. In a quarter mile, make a right but turn on North Columbia Center Boulevard. It's pretty the crazy to me right how busy this night has been. The last time I went out delivering, now it's been a long time, but I know I would have to sit there and wait 10 15 minutes in between orders with multiple Using apps. The right lane, make a right turn on North Columbia Center Boulevard. Um, and I haven't had that tonight. So, that's pretty amazing. Hope it stays busy. Um, once it slows down, I'll probably call it quits. So, I just did an order for Safeway for Instacart. Couple bags here. Um, it was pretty interesting. I got a message that someone forgot their Instacart card at home and had to be canceled, so I went and picked up the order. Um, it's six miles away and it's 745 so it should be around 8 when I'm done and I'm gonna call it so it's 808 p.m. I just got home from dropping off that Instacart order which funny story um, so I'm done driving two hours 35 minutes not bad not bad um, what happened with that order was someone had it and they said I lost my Instacart card and I can't pay for it so it has to get reassigned so I picked it up it popped up as an available batch um, got the I finished dropping off my last Uber Eats delivery went and chopped um, she said that the hot food because she ordered a lot of like fried chicken and stuff it was supposed to be for dinner uh to uh, refund all of that and have it because she ordered a pizza um because of the issue that came up 
So I don't really know if I'm getting paid the full amount or not. I hope so, because that's not my problem, but we'll see. Uh, but let's check out Uber Eats. So, oh, there's my total $31.82. Um, and I got a $3 tip, it says. <coughs> so on top of that, I also got a $5 cash tip. So I earned $31.82, so we're looking at $37 roughly, $36.82, and probably about an hour and a half, um, hour and a half to two hours, because there was the Instacart as well. Now let me switch to the Shopper app and see if my funds are there, if my earnings are updated. Let me go to earnings, earnings. Uh, currently at zero. So I guess that's the update, probably because of all the issues. Um, hopefully it's the $24. Like I said, that would be amazing. But if it's less, it's still going to be a pretty good turnout, um, considering I made $36 from Uber Eats, plus whatever this is. And that's like a two and a half hour so that's not bad at all. I'll update you once I know my earnings for this trip. If you like this video, be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Have a good night. Peace.